What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I'm going to show you how to install VIP Shop Management Cloud version, how to subscribe and install it. Um, it's really simple. Uh, but before I want to show you that, I was looking at my competitor, Shelf Monkey, and I'm looking at their prices. Their prices just went up. Um, their Clever Monkey was 174 and this one I think was 249 so it went up by a lot. And I'm not really surprised it went up because uh, when I got into the cloud, I understood how expensive uh, to have users on the cloud. And I was like, even I believe right now they're not making any money uh, because they have so many expenses. They have their investors they got to get paid and they have their, I mean, the $34 million that they raised, somebody's got to pay that money. And uh, they have uh, employees. So I was really surprised, like if it's costing me that much, I thought they're giving them a break or something and they're not. And I was like, okay, that, that's, that's weird. So that's why if you look at the $99 package that they have, there's nothing in it except creating invoicing pretty much. Uh, and VIN decode, even VIN decode, Carfax is not in it, parts online ordering is not in it. Uh, even scheduling, I don't even know what's in it. So yeah, for $99 with the Shop Monkey, you get literally nothing versus comparing to VIP Shop Management, keep that in mind. Anyway, let's get the monkey out of here. And let's start, let's, let me show you how to install VIP Shop Management for the cloud users. You don't need to install any of this. We're gonna make it, obviously, we're gonna update the website and make it easier where it says download and buy here or click here to start. Um, so you, and this in this case, I'm, we, I'm, I'm going to just download and go to uh, number four, we only need number four. We're gonna click on download, and you can, after you do that, you can close even the the website. I mean the browser. By the way, today uh, an internet company bought VIP Shop Management. I was surprised. I was like, "What do you need it for?" It turns out they want to use it for their own vans. So I was I was really happy. I was like, "I'm getting famous more and more." Anyway, let's talk about uh, the installation. So you get, once you get here, obviously you're gonna click on cloud database and we're gonna click on create account at the bottom, create account and type in your shop information. So I'm gonna type in just uh, my information because it's just a test account. And uh, make sure you type in the email. Like I, I definitely recommend using Gmail at, at this moment for you to sign in and sign out because this is, is going to be your username. Um, uh, but it's up to you. You don't have to use Gmail for signing in, but I definitely recommend that. And just type in your uh, contact name and click on create and then click on continue. And it's going to bring you right here. So you pay as you go with VIP shop management. Uh, I don't do recurring payments. Uh, that way you're in control better than you want to cancel and you're going to call me and tell me I want to cancel. Uh, so you don't have to. You pay as you go. So every uh, 30 days it reminds you and you go from there. So we're going to click on check out with PayPal. Remember, you don't have to. You have a PayPal account, but you can check out when you... It will give you the option to check out with a debit card. And we're going to click on... It's $99 uh, even. I click on pay now. And uh, once you're done, you can click here to expedite it. And it's going to bring you right here at this moment. Now you create your own password. So this is the, like I said, this is going to be the username that we added. And we're going to type in the password. Make sure you type in a strong password, like eight characters and more. And click on save. And just click on finish, and you're pretty much you're ready to go to set up your VIP. Um, at this moment, you can uh, um, actually now let's just set it up from here. So we're gonna click on login, and it's gonna bring you right here. Continue. Uh, your shop information is ready right here. You just click save, continue. Um, just enter your Gmail account. Um, sign in continue and the product key it's going to be already right there for you so just click on activate and done and that's it i mean you got to go through your settings and set up all your information like your sales tags and all that and your shop logo you can change that 
but you're all set. Um, for the second computer, all you have to do, download VIP shop management, it's gonna bring you here, and uh, just click on login, that's it. So that's how you log in every time, as simple as that. That's the beauty of a cloud, it's, uh, it's a luxury, like I said, it's a luxury. Um, uh, you will get with our VIP shop management, you get text messaging and uh, and uh, the online ordering all included uh, and uh, we will uh, update the website pretty soon uh, so you can see what you're getting with but if you can't wait at least you can see uh, you can download and start with VIP shop management cloud and I definitely recommend I know they're my competitor and it's gonna sound harsh me saying it but um, is this price gonna go up that's my other question like the other one went up because I promise you, they're not making any money on this too. So that's that's the problem. But anyway, man, that's why some people want. Sometimes they want to go with the bigger company. Uh, the bigger company, you gotta understand. There's so many people need to get paid, and I'm not dogging on that. But I'm just saying, who's gonna pay for it? I have no problem. But I understand. You know, I respect the fact that uh, they they gotta hire people and they're they're employing people. I have no problem with that. Eventually, VIP shop management will do so. But what I'm saying, I'm always cautious on expenses uh, moving forward. Like when I wanted to integrate um, uh, labor rate, he gave me a ridiculous price. And I was like, okay, that doesn't make any sense. So whatever doesn't make any sense to me, I don't try to push it on, uh, on, uh, on my, uh, my customers because it doesn't make any sense. It's a ripoff. Anytime there's a ripoff, I don't want it. And even though ShopMonkey are paying that ripoff price because I did ask and they, they said it's for everybody. So, I mean, I can, that's why I can imagine why now the labor lookup, uh, we're talking about $350. I mean, that's a lot of money. And I promise you, even here, they're not making money. Uh, I don't know, man. They gotta, that's their business. They got to figure out. Um, uh, online payments, it's, what is it, 2.7 in, in person, 2.7. I think it's 2.6 or 2.7 with the square plus 10 cents, not 15 cents. Uh, so, yeah, so even that, we can beat them with that. It's not a big deal. And plus, you get the square terminal. I don't know what kind of terminal is going to send you. I'm not sure about that. But anyway, yeah, that should do it. Uh, that's it for today. I appreciate you guys watching. Until next time, thanks.